<laughs> Hi there YouTube, it's Wild Mutation Blue um, and I've recently purchased some new Steelbook Protective Covers these are little plastic uh, gimmicks, gizmos, you could call them <laughs> call them whatever you want, I call mine Billy uh, I don't call them Billy at all, I just call them Protective Covers um, well, um, up to now, I've been using these like little bags with a little sticky thing on the back. Let's put them all in. Um, but I was watching a video that aid the bloody um, loaders up onto YouTube a couple of days ago, and he's recommending these new plastic ones that you can get um, from Steelbook Central on eBay. I've always got me protective covers from Steelbook Central, and I thought, great. Um, I'll get in touch with them um, and get some of these. Um, so they come like this. These these type have a little protective flap for your spine on your steelbook. Um, now I've been fiddling with these for quite a bit today, trying to get them to work the best way I can. Um, if you just fold them down there, then you've got like a little sort of structure to slide your steelbook into. Okay. Um, and then you fold these little flaps in, top and bottom, and then fold this a couple of times so it's pliable. This is your little steel buck flap, and a little flap for your spine. So I'll fold it back again. I'll be going to make out what I'm doing here, and then stick it back in. It's a bit fiddly, I have to say. Um, Stick it back in to there, and it'll go. It's, as I say, it's very fiddly. But now it's taking me forever. This well, it's kind of in, and I'll just get my fingers in here, stick them in properly. So that's in there. Then the object of this now is to get your steelbook and put them in here. Okay, so let's get it there, stick it in. Um, this little plastic stuff doesn't scratch your steelbooks while you slide it in or nothing like that. Okay, which is good. But it gets stuck at the end there, so what I've been doing is taking it, the little flap off, pushing the steelbook up to the top, and then having to stick it in at the end um, which again is very fiddly um, so what I decided to do was have a play with it see what's the best way I could get for this to work okay so what I ended up doing was rather than keeping those little flaps at the top and the bottom um, pushed in I pushed them down all the way instead Make that out there, there's a little flap there. That I've got at the top. Push it all in so it stays in. And then getting this and pushing it in again. My fingers inside. Pushing them in. Okay, so now that made it a lot easier for me. Um, so I can now just get my steel block and put it in there. And it slides in without any any problem. So that's the way I found. So it should just slip out nice and easy. Okay. I've cut my finger a little bit doing this. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that was the best way I got. So push those little foldy things which are supposed to stay out. Keep it secure. Push them top top to bottom. And then just slide your steel book in. And it shouldn't have any problem. And it makes it nice, it makes it look nicer than what it does. Um, with the flaps sticking up and down um, so you just got all this stuff there which isn't that much of a problem um, so you've got your steelbook all nice and secure because I was getting a bit fed up doing it earlier on what I decided to do was cut the edge the little flap off I just cut it off because it was doing me head in and so I can now just slip the steelbook in and push it out and that was nice and easy um, 
I might. I was thinking of just, 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 just <laughs> cutting all of them off the little flaps. Um, but because I've come up with this little way of doing it nice and easier, I've um, so you just it's out, and then you've got your little protective thing for your spine, and then just push them in. And that was nice and easy. Okay, so uh, I hope you like that. And these are far better than these little fuzzy bags, which you've got to always bloody open up and stuff. But you can just push them out and then push them back in. Hey, okay, I hope you like that. Um, and I'll leave a link to Steelbox Central and Aid the Bloody's channel underneath this for you to well, take a little look. See what you think. Alright, bye bye. Everyone knows.